gentlemen, coming to you live from the Dix Hills Ice Arena in Dix Hills, New York. This is Long Island Junior Royals Playoff Hockey here at FastHockey.com. And joined by David Tepper this evening, my name is Josh Hirsch. And tonight it's Game 3 of the Mullen Division Finals, winner take all between the Royals and the New Jersey Rockets. Mirror image of last weekend. The Royals up the right side. Over the red line, now into the Royals uh, Rockets zone onside. Kozlo looks, centers it through to Hall. It's stopped in front of the rebound. He scores. JT Hall does it again. His 10th goal of the playoffs. Two minutes, 15 seconds in the Royals lead. Get the puck to the net and good things are gonna happen. Bonsignor, as the puck taken over behind the net by Bruneau, tries to come out in front, Bonsignor, back and he scores! Bonsignor roofed it on a turnover in front of the net and the Royals lead by two. That's, they're getting a great start by the Royals, really getting the puck to the net every opportunity and that's two goals so far. Tough going so far. McGuire to hold it in. McGuire to Cartwright again. Looking. Back to McGuire, left side to Cartwright, trying to collapse it down low. Sends down low, and Shields scores! What a pass from Cartwright. Shields tips it in, the Royals go back on top. Great back to Hall. Hall to the circle, sends it in front, oh. and it is wide, and the net comes wow. off. How did, how did that one not go in there? It looked like it just got stuck on McGuire's stick, and he couldn't shoot it. his way out wow. to the blue line. Now sends it to Cartwright, right circle. Centers for Hall, blocked off of Sarlo's pass. Comes back to McGuire. Again, tips it in front, hit the post, the rebound, score! JT Hall does it again! 29 and a half seconds left in the period, it's 4-2 Royals. Very good puck movement on that play. Everyone was buzzing, cycling well. Got the puck to the net, first one hit the post, but he was there to put it, Hall was there to put in the rebound. The rocket line to Deber. Deber brings it in. Right side centering pass blocked by a sprawling Zavertis who I think knocked the net off in the process of that slide. And the Rockets bring it ahead right side, done. Stretch pass for Gambardella. Through the defense, Gambardella shoots safe, Cairo. Centering pass off the Got side it. of the Five on three is now over. Royal still on the power play for 53 seconds. Cartwright right side, sends back door. Hall scores! Another hat trick! What a pass! And another power play goal for the Royals. Tic tac toe on that one. Beautiful scoring play there. And good poise by Hall to really make sure he hit the back of the net with that one. Third, still 5-3 Royals. DePuz under the point, knocked away by Kozlo. Kozlo races ahead, he's got Hall, and he tips it to him. Hall's on a breakaway. Hall moves in, backhander, scores! What a move by Hall, and it's 6-3 Royals on his fourth goal of the game. An unbelievable pass in the neutral zone, feathered it through the legs of the defenseman to spring Hall on the breakaway. And now it's Kozlo who made the pass. And JT Hall picks up his fourth goal of the game tonight. And he now, I lost count, he now has 13 goals in six playoff games. He's just unstoppable right now. And 20 able to send it down to Viglucci into the Royal Zone. A Rocket Zone, a shot save, rebound, Shields, and a sprawling save by Sarlo. Great job by Sarlo to keep that puck out of the net, diving back across. And telling the far side wingers to move away from the faceoff circle. Gambardella wins the draw. DePuzo shoots from the point block. And here comes Twining on a breakaway. Kyle Twining moves in. Scores! And that one should seal it. Great wrist shot over the right, over the left shoulder and the glove side. The classic blocked shot from the point. Rush ahead. Really had a 2 on 0 with Shields. But decide to fire it over the shoulder. And a beautiful goal for Kyle Twining. And the Royals lead 7-3, and as you said, that just about wraps it up with 3.41 to go. Twining with his second goal of the playoffs. And the Royals are going to be heading to the Keegan Cup. I think the Royals are uh, happy to move on here as the puck sent back in. They tap their bench, and this one is over. The Royals win at 7-3. They are the Mullen Division champions, and they will move on to the Keegan Cup final tournament in a couple weeks time. Great effort and they really just shut the Rockets down for from the middle of the second period on.